our YouTube channel and click the bell to be notified when we post new videos. Hello guys, I hope you are doing great. You are welcome back to Kodadu Ravi Design Channel. In this video, I will be teaching you guys how to design a simple and classic by the flyer. But before diving into the video, if you are a new viewer or, you, or you've not subscribed to this channel before, please kindly do it by clicking on the subscribe button and put on the notification bell to get notified whenever I upload new and amazing video. And as for the returning viewers, thank you, I really appreciate it. So like I said earlier, I will be teaching you guys how you can design a simple and a classic uh, by the flyer. So the first thing I'll be showing you is that the size you will be using is a default pixel large size, which is one issue one, 1,280 1, by 1,280. This the widget and the height is 1,280. So this is the size you will be using, which is a default pixel large size. So the next thing we'll be doing is that we'll be changing the background color. We'll be using gradient color for the background. So you just click on this, you click on this plus icon here. So after clicking on the plus icon, you'll be having this new menu. So the next thing you'll be doing is that you click on this color on this uh, on this select your color. So we'll be using purple color as for our background. So this and we select you you click this then click this so you click this and click this to create your green color just like that then you click on ok then after creating this we want this uh we want the the color that is not as deep as the first one I want it to be at the middle, so you click on the place where I'm pointing the arrow. So you click on this, you can see now that uh, we have our uh, one color at the middle and the other color by the other side. So you click on OK. After creating the green color like this, so I will be importing the image of the selling brand from my gallery. So the image of the cell brand placed at the middle like this. After you must have import the image of the cell brand. So the next thing we'll be doing is that we're creating a fading gradient using the shape. So we're creating a, a fading gradient. In creating a fading gradient, so what you just have to do is that you click on gradient here, then move to you move to this first white and black gradient color you click on it then click on this plus icon you just create a gradient just like i've created the first one so you click on this then select the purple color you might select the color from your background then click on ok click on this click on color so the next thing you must have known in gradient is that this uh the third line here you drag it here then you click on ok you create your gradient like this so i will be putting a video a gradient if a video that will be explaining better how you can create a fading gradient in the video description so you click on ok like this then you place it on top then I will lock this to my screen interface to prevent the movement. So after creating this, the next thing we'll be doing is that we will be creating some uh, text. So okay. then we we'll go to our font. We we'll change the font. I'll be using an uh, imported font so you can get this from from a font site which is the font.com I will put in the name of the font in the video description so you can get the font from the font.com 
so we increase the size then place it here then the next thing is that i'll be changing the color for this let me find a suitable color for this let's use this blue color then i will go to stroke to add white stroke so the next thing i'm going to create another test the font as well the font for this is Aguilera the name of the font will be put in in the video description increase the size as well and change the color I will give it some uh, little strokes too. So you can use it like that. Then after this, I will import in some resources which I will put in the link to download these resources in the video description. This is a by the value. I'll be placing it here. Then I will raise this dress. I will raise it a little bit. Then I'm going to import another resource. This is, I will raise this too. To change it from, uh, from the square shape. So I will place this, I will be placing it here. I'll copy it. Copy it. Place it on top again. Then put it below the text. Then I will have to create the name of the celebrant next. name of the celebrant always do it on my own so i gotta get through it and the only thing i know is to love what i'm doing never give up never slow till i finally prove it never listen to the nose i just want to keep moving keep my head up when i act head up that's a fact never looking back i'ma keep myself on track keep my head up staying strong always moving on till i don't belong to Increase the size. Find the suitable font for it.
and place it below. So as you can see, this is how to create a simple and uh, an a classic by the flyer. So once you want to save your project, you click on save here. Once you click on save here, click on save, save as image. You select PNG for image format and ultra for quality so that you can have a, a high quality image. So you save as a, you save to a gallery. So that is all about creating this by the flyer. Thanks for watching. Never listen to the nose, I just wanna keep my